attacked uh, more furiously against Felix Trinidad, trying to push him back. It's been Trinidad. Oh. I mean, right now, too much, too much respect. He's Trinidad is backing him up. Oh, 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 you know, I've seen he's it. just using that right hand. I've seen it happen. I, even in the amateurs, if I hit a guy and drop him, I, I throw everything out the window sometimes. Look at this. Get anxious. Oh, the dream with a left hook. That time was on the other hand. Another left hook. That one shook him up a little more. Trinidad tightens up. There's a left hook by Trinidad off the... Used to be in bumble. And he opens up a sixth round with a couple of left hooks. Uh, stopped in midair again. Oh, he's got a nice right hand. It's as if Reed just knows he's too quick defensively for Felix Trinidad. Then he counters. Come on. Oh, come on. Wow. wow. 55, 3, 2, and 1 even. But the extra point there being the knockdown. For, for who? Who's, who's in favor of who? I have this in favor of Reed. I've, I've got it 57, 50. So not have believed that he could do this. Oh, oh, oh my Reed. You tell me when. Okay. Go! Oh, really that Trinidad putting in some boxes. Oh, that was a hell of a box. Oh, Reed, Reed's in trouble! Big right hand, left hook right hand. Go! Just a few seconds to go, though, on the round. Trinidad trying to finish the box. Saved by the ball. Watch it here. It comes up on the inside, right there. Delayed reaction. He never saw it. It came behind him. His elbow was out there. Came right inside his arm. And he got up on very rubbery legs down for the fourth time in his career. You can see that adrenaline. Oh, left hook by Trinidad. Some of the sweat wound up over here. Can see him. Looks like he's still a little bit of oh, straight right hand that tagged David Reed. Final seconds, round eight. Pomaski said the cut is not bad enough to uh, stop the fight right now at this point. Well, Reed's running out of eyes, continuing to droop, and the right eye has a cut over it. Does not bode well. Control over his legs. He slipped once and straight right hand there. And wobbles Reed. He's in trouble. He's in trouble. Under them a little bit. Yeah. And dad with the right hand leading now. Big left uppercut and left hook. First serious combination of the fight. And now Tiam stunned by the left. He's never faced a fighter with Trinidad's punching power before. And Mamadou Tiam obviously taken back by Felix Trinidad's strength. Tiam still wobbling as Trinidad looks for a rare early knockout. And look at the right. 
right eye of Mamadou Pian. That right eye is almost closed already. You know you got a hold. No one's taught this guy how to grab. Clinch. Hold on. You can't get out of it by fighting. Just hold him. Takes a left hook to the body. Blocks some of the other stuff upstairs. He had his gloves in front of his face. That hurts. And it pushes your thumb into your eye. That might have happened. Because Tiam's right eye is in bad shape. Tiam makes it out of the round. But plenty the worse for wear. Hey, hey. To his left. When you want to hit him, then go back to the, to the right for safety. But that eye is going to be the telling story tonight. Another huge left hook from Felix Trinidad, and Tiam comes back anyway. Here's a guy, Mamadou, who can take the punishment and still be there. Had it not been for that left eye, this could be a different story. Another uppercut starts his Tiam. Right eye, I'm sorry. to that kind of power before. Some fighters know about it, and some have never seen it. This is a new thing for him. You just can't cover up. You gotta move your head and your and your body. You just can't hold your, your hands up this time. When you sight it. Some guys, you can lay your hands up and let them punch on you. Some guys, they'll hurt you even through your gloves. Trinidad is that kind of puncher. Keep your head moving, your waist moving. Don't stand still for nothing. What is it about Felix Technique that makes him such a big puncher, George? He's just, it's something inborn. The old saying, he was blessed. But part of it is, is his commitment. He just doesn't have what nature has given Trinidad. It's not just power, it's also technique, I think, George. Oh, no, 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 this is pure technique. power. Some guys can do the same thing and nothing happens. The right this eye guy is grotesque. Kill. The right He's eye is strong. swollen, completely shut, totally grotesque. Not sure how long the doctor will let Tion continue. Particularly since he can't see Felix's left hand coming. Trinidad doesn't have big arms. He doesn't have exceptionally big shoulders. And like he looks stiff-legged in there sometimes. Yeah. It's like Bob Foster. They just do something. And Tiam can't have any more. Tiam asked the referee to stop the fight. His right eye simply too bad for him to continue. You hate to see them do it, but it wasn't going to get in August to set himself up for a meeting with Trinidad. Let's look back at some of the damage that was done toward the end. And that's when Mamadou Tiam decided he had enough. You can see how badly swollen the eye was. And Tiam seemed to realize that Trinidad's left hand... He is still undefeated and still the WBA Super Welterweight Champion of the World, Felix Pinto Trinidad! Don't do that, Don't do that! Then you got to back it up, though. Big left hook by Trinidad, and Vargas is stunned. Vargas is stunned and down. Sensational nice left hook. Trinidad can't go to the wheel. He's not playing around now. Second knockdown. Okay. But this is what Felix said he'd do. No three knockdown rule in effect. Punished to the body for seven or eight rounds. This is an unusual situation. Now he got hurt by right hand. Deadly and quick as Tito Trinidad. And Trinidad did everything he could to finish it right then and there. Give Vargas credit for showing some stability. Out of the way of those punches. How he does it, you don't know. Right hand lands for Trinidad. Vargas pops back with a left.
get his legs back under him. That's what he should be doing. There was a brutal body shot by Trinidad that set up this assault, but for... One of, one of Hard right hand by Trinidad. ...into the right eye of Trinidad. The first round. The young fighter seems to have gotten his feet under him. He takes a low blow. Keeps motioning Vargas back into the corner. Now Fernando wants to come out and fight. I really think it was Fernando uh, Vargas who had the momentum going before the stop. Or continues. Big left to the body. Felix backing straight up. What him to do? Spread that leg. What Good left hook by Vargas. Left hook to the body by Vargas. Close to the belt. Thumb because there are no thumbs on these gloves, Jim, but it was a glove. That's what Fernando would prefer. Well, well, let him see it. We can't do it. Trinidad making a comeback now in round six after having been thoroughly dominated in three, four, and five. And Vargas, who was moving away early in the round, elects to trade with Trinidad and gets the better of him for the moment. Amazing. 55-55, three rounds apiece. Tito Trinidad definitely caught up in round six. Now Vargas got to understand that these lateral... A little short with the you are. Now he lands one All in the All night, he's been waiting. Corner, talked to him for five minutes. Does a macho battle, and it's been all... Good left to the body by Vargas. Trinidad was hurting the body, and he went after it. He hit him again in the same spot, right above the, the, the trunk line there. The swelling. He hasn't blown his nose as like he did. You want to make sure you throw up a cut you're in the middle of the ring. A right hand from distance momentarily wobbles Vargas. Another combination. Vargas grabs and holds. Another big right hand by Trinidad. Vargas in trouble. He's taking another him back left up. to the body by Make Vargas. him back up. And another left to the body. Trinidad to the ribs. Right here. Right here. It's toughness of Vargas against I'm not the kind of fighter who'll run. I'll stand with him. I'll trade with him. I'll stick with him all the way. That's what Vargas does as he comes down the stretch in round nine. To go. Harold, both rounds were very close. One of the judges for this fight, Glenn Hamada, was also a judge for Trinidad de la Hoya, and he had that fight, 114-114. At another extremely close fight tonight. Ratner, the executive director of the Nevada State Athletic Commission, was two seats away. Meanwhile, they're still busting each other. Now, Trinidad has definitely had the edge in power. Well, then how's he gonna win the fight, George? Passion, commitment, pride, and absolute determination all the time. Try to match my will. That's what Felix Trinidad Good left hook inside by Vargas. Vargas with a momentary flash of offense. There you go, Vargas. He's beating him to the punch and he's rattling him. He's got his heart. He's got his pocket. Jim, there's no question. Out of the last four rounds, Tito Trinidad is released. Three. Down goes Vargas. Fernando Vargas must score a knockout or he's lost this fight. Down goes Fernando from instinct and courage. He's out of it. He can't see Trinidad. He's about to get knocked out. Fernando trying to survive. Fires a couple of punches and holds on like a skilled veteran. He's a veteran. And that'll do it. The third right hand, the third knockdown of the round. A huge victory for Tino Trinidad. He closes the show. Perfect left hand shot on the button by Felix Trinidad. And then seconds later, the second knockdown and the one that made it clear that Vargas would need a near miracle just to finish the fight. And a merciful Jay Nady, not bothering to count, but rather stepping in to end the onslaught and spare the brilliant young talent any further punishment at the hands of the devastating Trinidad. the WBA and IBF 154-pound world champion, Felix Tito Trinidad. This is boxing. Boxing lives on. Continue to support this beautiful and exciting sport. Thank you for watching. For more boxing stories, boxing fights, and boxing news, Subscribe on this channel. Click the notification bell for more updates. Because in this channel, together we will revive the boxing world.